my god mate, you're such a helmet. Hello, how are you? So I figured I'd just launch straight into this video. For anyone who didn't get that, that was me launching over, yeah. So... That was another launch joke. I am sorry. Making small talk is awkward. Why do we do it? Are we searching in vain for some sort of common ground? Why not the rare ground? I mean, I'm personally a fan of the uncommon ground, which is mostly Seinfeld and Keanu Reeves references. Don't stop the bus. To us, no one likes small talk, and I guess that's why clubbing's so popular. No small talk necessary. Or possible. Rarely attempted. Not once has someone mentioned the weather to me in a club. I was out once and amidst all the sitting, there was this girl just doing this towards me. Which was a bit unnerving. <laughs> like a twerk gone wrong. I wasn't sure if it was a mating dance or a tribal initiation or something, but I was worried. That's my point though. Point. Point. That's his point. He had a point and he made his point by relating it to a story. I think one of the reasons that our generation is so shocking at, let's face it, simple interaction is because of Facebook. If it all goes to shit on Facebook chat or the conversation runs stale, then just throw in a few emoticons and leave. You can't do that in real life. So yeah, that's why the weather's nice today. Oh, interesting. Then again, if we actually did perform emoticons during genuine, real-life human interaction, then it might increase the awkwardness. There are two kinds of people during small talk. Those who do not speak and avoid eye contact, and those who don't speak and just, just fix you with the most intense stare, and they sort of see into your soul a bit. You start feeling like Harry Potter with Snape, you just sort of empty your mind of all memories and emotions. I'm the third kind of person. If there's an awkward silence, then I have to fill it with anything. So yeah, um... Bilbo Baggins! That was Gandalf from Lord of the Rings. No, I, I know. I'm not sure why you did that. But seriously, small talk is not something that anyone should actively seek out and unless you're a midget who likes conversations, in which case all talk is small talk. There are people in these situations who don't reciprocate mentally or physically. I mean, but if you go for that, then you're flirting with quite a hefty jail sentence, so don't. Hey, where'd you get your top from? Oh, I don't know. Oh, it looks nice. Anyway, the reason I'm making this video is because recently I've been thrown into several kind of horrible small talk situations which weren't fun. I hate small talk. I was recently trapped in small talk for 37 days. Someone said they like my tie and it's all escalated from there. However, I think small talk could be a fantastic interrogation method for intelligence agencies. Take note, CIA. We've all awkwardly let something slip while searching for a topic. Just place a suspect with someone they sort of know through a mutual friend and let it happen. Now, I know the thing is CIA, where can I put torture in this? Don't. So yeah, I guess the moral of this video is don't socialise. Thanks for watching guys, my last video is right here, my Twitter Instagram book details are below, I will see you guys soon, goodbye.